Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So our group, uh, we're going to present on uh, automatic cow scratching machine that will be presented by me. Firstly, Siti Kadija Ahmad. Uh, my name is Anif Faida. Uh, my name is Nur Iza Bintizan Adili. My name is Ali Hadidin Ali. My name is Ibi Suri Dr. Ramadan. So let's start with our presentations. So do you have any idea what is uh, our main purpose having this kind of machine, especially for the cow? So for the background, that grooming has considerable uh, biology important to cow instead of human. So cow also need to groom themselves. So the most obvious important thing is by grooming, it will reduce the number of parasites and organisms, especially on the cow's coat. Is on their body. So beside that, grooming is actually by grooming, it will actually a good social activity for cow. So it will allow cow to bond with their teammates, which is between relationship between cow and the other cow, uh, to reduce the impact of the post cow or the submissive cow hierarchy between the herd, and also that is it is a way to cope with stressful situation. So by grooming is another method for the cow to release their stress and that, okay, that's for the background okay next we go to the problem statement why do we actually create this automatic scratch, scratching cow machine so uh, the first is uh, in confinement system moving objects are not always as available and secondly they are not easily assessed as they would be in custom system. So therefore, many producers and their equipment companies are looking ways to improve current environments during environmental enrichment. So next slide. So what is environmental environmental enrichment? So it is enhancements of both animals' physical and social environment. So by using these automatic scratching machines, animals will be clean and the pores are in, uh, in the skin are open. So by this uh, cleaning, it will stimulate the blood circulation and hence the, per the performance of the herd will arise due to the increasing yield of milk. So uh, besides that, uh, uh, using automatic scratching machines, Accidents from the cow are prevented because they no longer use uh, uh, something to rub them, uh, rub against something to scratch themselves. So basically, uh, from this figure, we can uh, this example of one of the design cow scratching machine. Uh, in cow scratching machine control board system, basically, basically uh, they consist of uh, microcontroller based control board. And this control card will automatically run the brush motor by detecting that cow and the cow will lean against the brush uh, with the help of sensor. Next, we proceed to the tra traditional business model. Okay, so, so now we know uh, there, is a, uh, there is a model uh, machine, catchers, machine. So, how about before the model uh, exists, the modern one uh, of catchers exists? So it's a traditional and also the modern cow scratchers. What the difference? So the first is traditional cow scratchers. Okay, Trad traditional cow scratchers. First, the cow will rub themselves whenever they have, especially whenever uh, they find any object that they can rub their bodies, such as trees, fence posts. Um, and also the, it can be uh, the tractor itself. So, uh, for example, there is a rubbing, rubbing stone for uh, special for cow to rub themselves, which is in uh, which is in uh, that we call carrying stones that carrying post that this uh, this stone can if it, it, it is dug, uh, it is need to be well dug into the ground. And uh, it is and and we could ensure that uh, it can withstand the weight and the strength.
of your character when it drop at the school. So uh, that is a uh, traditional one. And then uh, why it uh, it uh, why the rubbing stone uh, is being treated because it to prevent uh, how to rub themselves at the uh, at the uh, fence post where it can damage the infrastructure field. And then modern cow stretchers. So the modern cow stretchers they use uh, automatic controls that the cow will. Uh, start up the brushing itself automatically by the cows uh, lift up, slight lift up, lift up the brush, and then the briskly swizzling uh, motorized brush uh, will spins when the cow touch it. So these things allows the animal to reach uh, the to reach the place where it can yank that it that it want that it, the cow want to be rubbed. Whenever uh, it, the cow one uh, that didn't need any person to help the cow by uh, by its its own. So, for example, this mechanical brush. Okay, I uh, I proceed to my challenge. Okay. So every machine they have has some they have materials or method to make sure that the process of the machine. Uh, will work smoothly according to their purpose for their person method. So for this part, which is the scratching machine for the cow, there are a few sensors that used to for this machine. Firstly, there are firstly there is a mercury contact sensor. This sensor is used on the control card to detect that the cow is against the brush. So this is the sensor used for in this machine, there are two sensors used to detect uh, where will the sensor work, uh, especially when the cow means on here. So there's a mercury drop in, in mercury contact sensors on the control card, move when the cow lean against the brush to scratch it, and it triggers the sensor by making short circuit to contact. So below one, is, uh, this is a picture of the mercury contact sensor that used for the machine. So another uh, sensor is a transformer of 3.2 watt to 3.0 per 12 watt, which is this transformer is used for the supply of the control card. So, AC signal was converted to DC signal by using one pitch diode at the output of the transformer. So, the 12 volt value will be converted to DC signal for decrease to 5 volt that will supply the micro controller card by using 7805 IC. So, this is uh, the part of the Control it, they will use the speedy unit on the control card. So the third one will be the PIC 12F675 controller, which is a microcontroller that invented, uh, that produced by the microchip uh, version. So uh, how it works it is uh, when the logic is zero, while the value of the pins, the material contract sensors can access the IC 125675. My control does not allow output. So when the end one of the mercury contact sensor of mercury contact sensor is triggered, mercury sensor allow output and data information that logic is one. Come to the IC one two five six seven five micro controller. So this is the mass sensors, the part of the sensor and also the microcontroller used for this machine. The next, so another sensor will be used is L and three five temperature sensor. This is to control the sensor. Uh, on the control card. So another thing is a 4 m fuse fuse for the current uh, used at the output of the circuit to protect the motor from overloading. And it will, instead of the battery sensor, it will use a speaker. So by having this speaker, which is 0 0.5 watt speaker, it will use to convert one of the 8 mainly signal in the M3481 contributed to our reality. So it will detect the sound that made by the cow when they are leaning against the uh, scratch machine. So UM3481 IC on the control card it will be triggered by the PIC. Want to have system control. So by having this kind of sensor, it will prevent the cow to get operate and to really feel. So this kind of sensor will actually help them to release the stress and to prevent them from easily to be scared when they are leaning against the scratch machine. So this is the general appearance of the control card, having a speaker, having a uh, 
optimize for the microcontroller and so on. So the explosive to that. So this is the CP diagram of the system, which is the scratching machine. So all the sensors have uh, been drawn according to the diagram, uh, which is the suitable position to organize the, all the sensors. And also it will depend on the function of all function of all of the sensors itself. So next, let's proceed to Amira. So uh, I will continue with the program of this automatic power station system. So for the input data is when the cow uh, lives on the brush that through the sensor the signal will send to the control element which is the microcontroller. So the microcontroller will send, uh, will run a motor that is connected to the brush which is the, uh, the body system. So this will, this will uh, give the output of the brush will rotate or revolving for 20 seconds and the variety will start uh, simultaneously. Yeah, so uh, yeah, yeah. during 20 seconds, during 30 seconds, if the cow lean back on the brush, then you will feel the feedback path uh, through the feedback element which is the mercury contact sensors and the system will start again. Uh, so this is what I explained just now. So uh, the system also use uh, programming, which is the PIC basic pro programming language was used for the software of PIC 12F675 microcontroller. So this is uh, the flow diagram of the programming. So where to start? Then uh, the programming goes to the first divisions where the, the sensor and the output. If yes, then it goes to the uh, output, which is the operate the engine for 30 seconds and play the very simultaneously. Then the programming uh, goes to the second division, which is if the temperature exceeds 55 uh, degrees Celsius or not. If exit, if yes, then the engine will stop and the melody will also stop simultaneously. If no, then the system can be, the automatic cow scratching system will be, can be start again if the cow in on the brush. So uh, then the system goes to the end. Next, I will pass to the test for the completion. Thanks to Mira, I will conclude the uh, presentation. So, the presentation is about a uh, cow scratching machine. So, an electronic cart that runs cow scratching machine of which the use expense in business we vary automatically cow was developed. So, our, our, our cow scratching machine is uh, depend on the electronic cart. So, it, it will be like we put the program, so it will be function and it will be in milk. So the, this precision uh, herd management system function with sensor and micro, uh, microcontroller in how the so the microcontroller is depends on the card, the control card, how, how we program the control card. So uh, they have a sensor to detect the cow's uh, behavior. So the third one is a uh, automatic cow scratching machine is very uh, is an easy way to help enrich dairy cow environment and have possible benefits for the fulfillment of uh, nature behavior. So, uh, uh, apart from the system, so we, uh, we have uh, improvement, so we could improve the system to the higher level to increase the yield of milk. So, uh, a missing system, so on the machine we will be, we conclude so uh, the cow can cool, cool itself, so especially in summer. Uh, so in, in summer time, you can design this part. So uh, it, uh, the cow can cool itself. Uh, those, uh, when the brush start working, the missing system can be automatically activated. So when the brush is starting, uh, when the program is starting, the brush will be starting by motor. Motor is uh, uh, starting the automatically activated. So an approve. Approve means is uh, 
erasable, programmable, read only memory. It's a chip, it means a chip that will be retained the data whenever the power is switched off. Uh, as we see in our in our uh, experiment something, uh, we have uh, put the motto. So when the put uh, motto is uh, switch off, they still uh, can continue uh, supply the melody or something to cool down or relax the cow. So um, uh, it's this used for different melody from eight melodies in UM3481 IC on control card to be played. It's a uh, previous experiment is like convert one melody from the uh, convert one from eight melody. It's different because we can uh, we can provide different melodies so the cow can enjoy the melodies. So those the different melodies can be played by loading the design melody in the background. Okay. That's all for me. Thank you.